Hello there everyone and thank you for joining me here at the start of a new campaign in Old World Blues, A to Z series in which we're playing now is Dramate. Led by the Masquerade. If you'd like to read about the Masquerade, please go right ahead. But we have Abolishing Want. We don't have no wants here. We've got Clean Water. We've got Aware Vice City. And we are kind of wealthy from what we do. But we're going to go to World Vault 27. They have up to five divisions and they have robots which is not good for us. But unlike them, we have numbers, so we're going to try to surround these enemies and kill them off as best we can, or just try to VPP snipe them all. We're probably just going to try to end up VP sniping them. Um, hope this goes well, because if not, we're kind of screwed. But we're fighting the schools here, give more civilian research speed, as we're trying to get research slot as well. Um, let's see what we can actually do here. Do the enemies do anything? Go ahead and try to attack them. Oh! Where did it go to? Fargo, huh? You know what? You go here and do that first, and then come back up north and do that that. Guys, we have no piercing power. Not good, I know. Um, hopefully we can reduce our organization to nothing, but we got Ohm's Law. We'll see what else we can do. The reference banners are nice. Um, we're doing this just so we can get some extra uh, political power and whatnot, but we have a couple things working for us already here. Actually, we are very primitive, to say the least. Uh, can't go to every cup for the army, but we will grab, what? A little more political power, a little more stability first. Um, the mods we're using for this campaign are <clears throat> Old World Blues, Old, Blue, Old World Blues Radio, they're pretty standard stuff. Oh, look, they actually are all stuck here. Nice. Um, we're also using Old World Blues Tech Expanded, or Tech Expanded mod, as well as Fast Justification War mod, just because we can. Oh, oh, oh god, oh god, they have another division. Oh no. Oh crap. Oh, is that enough though? Oh, it is enough to get Vault 37. Beautiful, my friends. So we start off a little stronger. We might have fight the Roaches. Um, two peoples. We definitely have to spend some time uh, making sure that we have enough territory to move. But two to four divisions? Oh, that's so tempting! If they've only up to four divisions, that's super, super, super tempting. Also, as you see, we do have kind of a unique icon. Uh, the Masquerade Brigade. But they're just straight infantry. And we have the Sissiton Troop, as well as the Aberdeen Troop. And we're going to train. We're going to go ahead and do this as well. We're going to do Wasteland Pacification. And the troop is going to do that. Just literally just straight infantry, so that's really fine. Garrisons go up, because we don't want any damage to guard garrisons. They have up to three divisions now, and they're a bunch of roaches with anti-tank, which is not good for us, but, you know, whatever. Scout, uh, do that stuff, get some weekly manpower. That's not going to be very much, but whatever. Hopefully mobilizing a little bit more, you know, the good stuff. So if they have only three divisions, we should be okay. We should be able to move around them and take out all their VPs while encircling them. But there's no guarantee, of course. Uh, let's see, civilized tech... Our technology is not very good. It's actually really bad. Get some daily army XP as well. And we're going to grab some more stability. Because stability will help us core stuff slightly faster. Or at least help reduce resistance because it's quite high. Go ahead and construct an agency so we can get an agent so we can lower uh, the penalty for stability and whatnot. And we're doing okay. Give a little bit of time because they are going to get hit very hard. Establishing a laboratory. Erect a palisade. Sure, why not? And we have finally have a fifth research slot, even though we are not very advanced at all. Go figure. Alright. A few more days for that, and then we're going to start moving out. Roach King, attack, defensive core territory. I hope we do well here. If not, well, we're kind of screwed. So, you know what? Just in case, let's save again. Because saving is always a good thing to do. And here we go. Come on. She's a bit laggy. Forgive her. So what I want to do is take just take all the territory. You just do that. You expand out. You do that. Well, these guys are going to be moving out, hopefully. And literally just encircling these guys as much as possible. So as soon as they start moving, we're going to start attacking. Will it be a good attack? Well, we got to exterminate some roaches. There you go. Well, now they're encircled. Which is actually pretty nice. Uh oh, they do have a like a rare division over here too. Um, that being said, do they have armor? They don't have armor, which is actually really good for us. I want to do a force defense. I want us to be able to take all these tiles. And we're actually doing okay-ish here and okay-ish here. Not fantastic. We're doing okay-ish. We need more organization of the first. You die, you die. I'm not super concerned. As long as we get rid of the other divisions, that's what I really care about more. Um, just take these guys out first. Sneaking dudes. That sucks. And just any parts and stuff. There we go. Actually, if anything, that's actually really good for us. Since they abandoned uh, the capital, 
Well, okay. Granting a little bit more army XP is good too. All right then. I'd say we were pretty darn successful in the first five minutes of this video. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And here we are at everybody. We have no manpower. The, the Republic of Three Rivers has gone to war with us, and uh, yeah, we're doing we're doing okay. They've they've lost quite a few divisions, a couple of them. They have lost almost twelve thousand men, or you know manpower. Um, and at this point, we're going to activate our ciphers and do a general attack. Hopefully, we can do okay with no manpower, but. You never know as we're trying to go up this way and then up to here, then up to there to make some sort of encirclement for the love of God. Please let us encircle them. Why did you abandon your post? What the heck? But it looks like they can't do very much. Um, they do have air superiority, unfortunately. Uh, where are you going? Oh, that's interesting. I was not expecting that, but okay. Please head that direction. We just need to encircle them and can't. Oh, yes, we can. Yes, we did. Very nice. Help them out. Help them out. We take that town instead of this one. You can circle these guys right here. Would you look at that? Beautiful. Do we have land doctrine? Oh, well, sort of, but not really. Help them out, why not? Get rid of those free fighters, those garbage free fighters. And have fun. I'm going to actually keep you guys right here, right? Quick. Just because I don't want them to attack us through there. But we're destroying them. Uh, I guess the nomads of the far north are also there. Um, shaft mining. Sure. Nomads? Because we're fighting these guys, and then these guys. Oh, they're just next to the left of them. Here. Um, I don't know if we're actually going to go all the way over there. We'll probably just take out the Republic of the Three Rivers, because that's pretty much all we can really afford. So, yeah. We'll see. But I think they're out of manpower. We did have a couple divisions over here, too. 29 divisions left. They are out of manpower, which is very, very helpful. Thank God. And anything else? Really? Not too much. No. More special forces would be good. Plenty of caps in this campaign. I'm a little surprised that we had so many caps still available, but whatever. Fallback lines, marching drills, a little more speed is always nice. Come over here and improve our infantry a little bit more. Kill all these guys off if you possibly can. And we're doing okay. We're definitely doing okay. And there you go. Alright, so at this point, let's break these guys up. You guys go right there. Y'all do that. You guys go right there. And y'all do that. Y'all are gonna go like right here. And y'all do this. But well, the main front is right there. And y'all do that. Should be fine overall. Shouldn't have too many issues, but probably just enough. As we're building up more roads. Because roads are nice. Neither. Huh? Oh! Well, that was really fast, actually. Well then. Um, honestly, because of this type of nation, they're very primitive, they're very basic, I don't really feel like continuing on with uh, probably this campaign. We've done we've done decent. We've done really decent. Expanded in ways I didn't think we'd actually expand like this. But I really don't want to fight through the Old Believers to get to the Menace Congress just to grind them out for, well, to be told, not very much reward. So... Um, so we might just end it there. Uh, yeah, you know what? We'll grab that this technology. I did this technology just so, just so we get some armor on our special forces, but at this point, it doesn't matter too much. We ended with two, two point, almost 2.6 political power every single day. Masquerade, the Dramate is an okay nation. It's a little tough to play as, though, because they're so primitive as we are right here. Look at all this very basic level stuff we have, so... If you enjoyed the video, though, leave a like, subscribe if you're new, check out my Discord link in the description below, and I'll see you tomorrow in another campaign. Thanks for watching. Have a great rest of your day.